My name is Tom Whitehead and I'm co-founder of the Emily Whitehead Foundation. The Emily Whitehead Foundation is dedicated to helping families, children, and researchers fight cancer. My husband and I started the foundation in honor of our daughter Emily. My wife and I only have one child and she was healthy up until she turned five years old and then we were told that uh, she had leukemia. Her leukemia was resistant to treatment. As parents, it just, you know, slowly destroys you inside. Sixteen months into Emily's treatment, she relapsed. We did another month of chemotherapy, trying to get her back into remission, which was not successful. And the doctor at Hershey said, we're, we're done. We don't have any more weapons to fight Emily's cancer, so we'll set up hospice for you. It just made us want to fight even harder, and we were willing to do whatever it took to find Emily a treatment. She ended up becoming the first child in the world in the T-cell therapy trial to have her immune system trained to fight cancer. Emily is now four and a half years cancer-free after T-cell therapy. When Emily got home and, and she was doing good, I felt like we had a new calling for what we were supposed to do in life, and it eventually turned into, hey, we should start our own foundation. We created the Emily Whitehead Foundation to fund T-cell research for pediatric cancer, and we also want to raise awareness for childhood cancer as well as cancer research and immunotherapy treatments. We just do whatever it takes to help others have the same success that we do. The McMahon family from Atlanta called me and said, our son, Connor's 15 years old, he's a hockey player. He was on his third relapse and, and his life was at risk. And he looked at me and said, I want to get that treatment that Emily got. Connor entered the trial. When they found out Connor was cancer free, uh, I was the first person. They called. So that's why I keep doing what I'm doing. I was actually planning my own funeral and given three weeks left to live when I first reached out to them. And Tom and Carrie welcomed my call and I think every day we talked and they helped in some way uh, to get me out there and get treatment. I said, um, if you want to continue to fight, I'll do anything in our power to help you get there. She got into the trial. 28 days later, she was cancer-free and remains that way today. I went from planning my own funeral with only a few weeks left to live to being cancer-free in less than two months. Nicole is really an amazing person. She's very inspirational. She loves to share her story. She loves to help the patients as well. They constantly help other families and patients that have had similar situations to my story and Emily's. And um, it's an organization that's really focused on helping others and paying it forward.